Ladies and gentlemen, shit has gone down. Flynn has just been stabbed last episode. Let's just get into it. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Save him. I will go with you. Uh, no, no, Rapunzel. Uh, uh, I'll never run. I'll never try to escape. Just let me heal him, and you and I will be together forever, just like you want. Everything will be the way it was. I promise. Just like you want. Just. Let me heal him. In case you get any ideas about following us. You... Eugene! Come on, you could show the blood. Oh, I'm so sorry. Everything is gonna be okay, though. No, Rapunzel. I promise. You have to trust me. No. I can't let you do this. And I can't let you die. But if you do this... But if you do this, then you will die. Hey, it's gonna be alright. Yeah, because he's gonna cut your hair. Rapunzel. Power is gone. What have you done? What have you done? Oh, Jesus. Oh, yeah, she's definitely going to turn into a big old heartless. Oh yeah, she big dead. She big ol' heartless now. Turn into that heartless. Do it. Oh. Fall into darkness. We can't allow her near our pure light now. Her presence would only cast a pall over it. Yo, big old boss fight. What the fuck? What the fuck is this? I feel like favorite deputy is the move here. It's over. 
Fuck. Nah, use the flow motion of the tower. Uh-oh. This is gonna hurt. I forgot to equip potions again. Fucking hell, man! This is insanity! Come on! Boom! Hell yeah! Jesus, that was terrifying. Don't go. Stay with me, Eugene. Bring back what once hey. was fine. Rapunzel. What? Uh, Rapunzel. You were my new dream. 
And you were mine. Don't worry, I got a Kubo coin in my inventory. He'll be okay. The Kubos will protect him. <laughs> Moogles, please. I got a Kubo coin. Use healing magic. Has been hurt. Change the fate's design. Save what has been lost. Bring back what once was mine. What once was mine. His wound is healing. Did I ever tell you I've got a thing for brunettes? <gasps> Bruh. Eugene. So do we gotta get you back to the tower now? Or back to the town? Wow, Rapunzel, you're finally gonna get to see your real home. I know. I mean, I can't believe it. I can finally be with my real family. I couldn't have done it without your help. I mean, you actually, you can. You have a whole movie without us in it, but uh, hey. Well, from where I'm standing, the kingdom couldn't ask for a better princess. And I couldn't have asked for better sidekicks. Thanks. Yes, thank you so much. Mm -hmm. Now, Flynn, you and Maximus play nice. Huh? Okay. <laughs> You're gonna be great. So, can I unequip that shit from uh, Flynn? We haven't Flynn? seen the guy controlling the monsters in a while, so that's one less worry. But there's still a chance that he might be around here somewhere. Well, if he comes back and tries to bother Rapunzel again, then Flynn will keep her safe. <laughs> and we three won't be far behind. Damn. True. But nevertheless, I won't let her out of my sight. Oh, Eugene. Please. Eugene? Oh, <laughs> that's my real name. Eugene Fitzherbert. <laughs> That's right. I never told you guys. I'm still gonna call you Flynn. Well, I think it's a great name. Nah, I'm Me still gonna too. call you Flynn. Nice to re-meet you, Eugene. Hey, I thought I was the only one you were going to tell. Don't worry. I've saved plenty of Fitzherberty secrets just for you. Whoa! Hey, what are you two lovebirds talking about? Nothing. <laughs> Nothing. Can you say that in a kid's show? Yeah, it's not nice to keep secrets. Goofy. This one is none of your business. Oh my god, he really was talking about sex. Maximus, get him. Huh? <laughs> you have got to be kidding me. Kingdom of Corona, which means we're about to get another nice 15 minutes of cutscenes ever after. Ooh, yep. 
Emphasis on magic means I probably won't use it. Maleficent? The fuck are you doing here? Another world where we got doodly squat. Hmm. You sure this box thingy's even real? Yes. Yeah, just how do you know that? It is etched. It's what? Come with me. Where to? Those bozos ain't gonna help us. Sora sure not looking for the box. Who said anything about following them? No. Let me unequip that shit from Flynn real fast. Don't just put me in the gummy ship or you're a fucking dick. I swear to God, don't do it. Don't just do it. Don't do it. Don't you fucking dare. <laughs> don't fucking do it. God damn it. What? We're too late? Yes. Evan would know all about the replicas from his time as Vexen in the organization. He was re-completed like the rest of us, but he didn't regain consciousness. After Lee left, he must have woken and taken his leave. Alias here and Dylan went out and turned the whole town upside down to try and find him. But no Evan. That's not good. What about his research? Unfortunately, his work on the replicas was incomplete. There may still be documents around, but all of them from well before he made any significant progress. Do you have any idea where he might go? There's no place that he could go now that he's human. He has no means of leaving this world. But dark corridors... ...are beyond his faculties and mine now. Are you sure? Because what if he gave his heart to darkness again? Oh. But not everyone's. What if Evan was taken? Of course! The organization could also use the replicas. To fill out their ranks. We better go tell Master Yen Sid. And Sora. And the others, too. Hmm. <laughs> See, my only question is, why is Marluxius still part of the organization? Because at the end of uh, Chain of Memories, you beat him and defeat his nobody, sending him back to his body. So how the fuck did he become a nobody again? Or did he become a nobody again? Humanity is a precious gift. And yet you desire to return to the organization? Oh yes, of course. Yep, One there's eradication Evan. at Axel's hands was enough to learn where not to place my trust. He gave you a second lease on life. He ripped me away from the one thing I care about. I don't require humanity. Give me my research. I must see it to fruition, no matter the cost. The replicas. Yes. <laughs> Soon they will replace, not just replicate. Given a heart, they can become just as real as any human. What excellent tidings. I would hate to think we invited you back into our ranks, only for you to fail to deliver our final vessel, Vexen. <laughs> <laughs> My only question is, is he working for the old organization or the new organization? Why? Why do they both have to be called Organization 13? Hey, a new zone! You guys should check it out! Two new worlds, huh? Okay, well, before we do that, 
go back here. Because I told you not to fucking kick me out of here. Ron Punzel can do amazing things with the super long hair, but it must be a ton of work. Hashtag Rapunzel, hashtag long hair, hashtag kingdom of Corona. Yeah, but real talk, she doesn't have that long hair, Sora, so uh, what the fuck you mean she can do real shit with that hair? Get that sh fucking shit out of here. Get that motherfucking bullshit out of here, motherfucking nigga boy. Just gotta unequip that shit from Flynn real fast and give it to myself and Goofy because we got a new equipment slots and all that good shit. <clears throat> I really hope I can unequip it from Flynn anyways. That'd be bad if I couldn't. Nope, we can't. Thank God. Or excuse me, Eugene. Put that shield belt on. And, uh, yeah. I don't need MP haste. I'd rather have Rising Spiral. All right, catch you around, Eugene. So we got Arendelle as one of those new worlds, which is Frozen World. And we got, uh, what else was that other one? Metropolis. Air, I'm sorry. Why? The recommended level is 24? The fuck is this? The fuck is this? I'm about to get fucked. Yeah, high wind level one. I've really got to upgrade my gummy ship sometime. To Big Hero 6 world. <laughs> this is fine. Recommended level is 24. I am 18. Oh. how you use that. Good to know. World home. Not World Ho. Also, that is not Big Hero 6. It's actually Monsters, Inc.
Ow! Bitch! Yeah, I really gotta upgrade my gummy ship. Cause this shit is garbage! I need more gun. And mobility. Not so much health. Just guns and mobility. Ah, maybe help. Good god, you still have another full fucking health bar. This is hot garbage. Jesus. Hot garbage. Yes, because we unlocked the teleport spot. So let me go ahead and make a new gummy ship real fast. Just so we don't have to deal with this shit again.
There we go. We got a new gummy ship. And it will be called... Ship. And we'll call this baby. Fuck it. There. We got our gummy ships. There we go. Let's do it. Also, apparently I have to make the drive again. Unfortunate. Man, look at all these extra guns we have now. Fuck it.
Holy shit, that was scary. That was real scary. Away we go. Let's go. The leaves in the trees seem here. Or the leaves in the trees here seem to whisper unspoken words, unspoken feelings. So it's my turn to fight for you again. Who the fuck took this picture? Was it Merlin? Was Merlin creeping? Merlin secretly a perv, man? What other kind of pictures is Merlin taking if he's taking pictures and no one else is paying attention, huh? What the fuck you doing, Merlin? Who the fuck took this picture? It annoys me a lot more than it should. But who took the picture? Like with the Rapunzel one, it's very easy for Sora to take it. That one was easy. Not even gonna mention. God, mm -hmm. Goofy, your eyes terrify oh. me. Oh. What? Oh. D Donald, Goofy, why do you guys look like monsters? No, no, no. Well, you both scared me. Uh. Whoa. Seriously? Is this how we blend in here? That's right. It's about time you got in. Oh. <laughs> Where did my Could pants you guys go? Take a few steps back. You're giving me the heebie jeebies. You take uh, a step back. Come on. I think our new look could turn out to be lots of fun. God, Goofy, why do your eyes not match? Wonder what kind of weirdos live here. Who the thunk he'd get so creeped out? <laughs> it says we scare because we care. Good job, Sora. You can read. Doesn't sound very caring. Also, why is it night? If they look like us, then they could be trouble. I think we better investigate. Why are we doing this at night? The fuck? Monsteropolis. Give me a save point and we'll call it there. Just hurry up and give me a save point, please. God damn it, another cutscene. Oh, whoa. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> oh, whoa. Wee. Hmm? I wonder who those guys are. What? Can't Sully, if they see the KID. That's fine. We got nothing to hide. But you're the CEO! You set the example! Mm. Guys! Guys! It, it's not what it looks like! Okay, listen. That kid over there just popped out of nowhere! <sighs> we gotta call the CDA. Uh, it's a. Uh, uh, oh yeah! A code 835. <laughs> Are you trying to scare that little girl? Yes! I mean, no, no, no! We're done with scare power! Nobody's getting scared! <laughs> Mike. Take it easy. You should too, Sora. You see? She's happy. <laughs> so this takes place after Monsters, Inc. After the door scene at the end of the movie. I'm not ready for these emotions. Hello? My name is Sora. Oh, is that your name? 
Nice to meet you, Boo. <laughs> huh? Hold on! You guys really aren't afraid of humans? Mike Wazowski! Huh? Come on, Boo! I'm Mike Wazowski! Mike Wazowski! <laughs> well, you can see the resemblance. That googly bear eye. What's going on? I'm Mike Wazowski! <laughs> I'm Goofy. Well, my name's Sully, and this is... Oh, we know. Mike Wazowski, right? Bruh. What's the matter, Boo? Heartless. Oh, shit. Come on. You know what? I'm, I'm gonna end it here. I'm sorry. I gotta pee real badly. So I'm ending it here. See you in the next episode.